Today's video is being sponsored by Blizzard. Today, we're going to be taking a first look at Warcraft Rumble. Warcraft Rumble is a Blizzard quality game on the go, and we have a lot going on in here, and we got to get to work here because we're already under attack. The nice thing about this is it's very easy to learn the basic concepts of this game. It's very easy to pick up and kind of play, but it's hard to master all those like fine skills that you need to know. You're going to have heroes, you're going to have different troops, and we'll talk about that as we kind of get going here today. This is actually my hero right up here, uh, Rend. He's, he's going to work. He's pretty strong. He rides on a drake. I love it. And then we just kind of support with like different other troops. We're going, this is a PvE mission right here, the single player. So we're taking on a essentially computer boss here trying to defeat the stage and progress further in over 70 different missions so there's a lot to get you going so you can like learn and understand all those concepts i've been kind of just picking it up and going deep into this kind of gameplay and there's a lot in here guys and some of these missions i thought like they, these would be like give me missions some of these missions are tough and we'll check out a lot of this today we'll play around with some of the new characters we'll check out some of these characters that i haven't even unlocked yet as we get going through here but you really want to like find those combos that are going to work together. It's like any kind of like lane defense type game like this. You really want to find those right combos, string them together, and just make some strong pushes. So let's go ahead. Let's get our hero back out. Let's go ahead and get some ground support with him as well there. And now he's got a nice little talent I used where once he takes a little bit of damage, he's actually going to hop off of his drake. And then the drake's going to keep flying and then he's going to go attack also we also have the spell right here i haven't even tried this it's brand new the execute spell does massive damage to some enemies yeah i like this guys and then check this out like even if we want we could go ahead and we can support our hero up here with with this flying uh i, I forget what it is but it's it's a, it's a flying character it's, it flies right in there uh I, i'm learning the names guys you'll have to excuse me you know it, it's a brand new game we, we gotta learn we gotta figure things out but let's go in here let's go let's go with our hero again our hero is already ready you can use these little guys to grab some extra gold and kind of keep you working through here and help you uh get more characters onto the battlefield quicker Go ahead and put this in it's a little beefy uh and then some maps you will also like designate which way your troops are going to go how you're going to direct them so there's actually a lot going on here let's throw this, this little rocket launcher things these are really annoying uh let's, let's go ahead and work through here okay nice what is this there's like a little drill oh my goodness these guys are these guys are all up in my grill right now i don't like it i don't like it uh and you see as we like take down their like turrets and defenses and stuff uh, we'll start to build our own, which I really like this. These games are pretty intense. This is, like I said, this is PvE, uh, essentially going against like a computer AI type boss, but they can be really intense. I should have put him up there. I should have put him up there. Let's put this flying character up here. Uh, that way we would have been good. Look at that. We got some rockets all over the place. Oh boy. Oh boy. That was a lot of damage. All right. We're good. We're good. All right. Watch this push we're going to do right here. I want to try to get close to eight. Once we do, we're going to... Oh yeah, this is this is gonna overwhelm. This is this is gonna do it. We're gonna take down their boss right here. All right, let's go. We're going. This is our push right here. You see that little guy in the back? He does like a little splash damage. Here comes our hero working in here. Yeah, we'll check out some of the names again. I'm still learning. I know my hero's name is Rend, and he's a beast. But I do. You can unlock more heroes, and you can build other decks. It's not just stuck to one, so to speak. Uh, let's go ahead and finish this off, and there we go. We beat the level. Let's go ahead and let's take a look at some of these minis. So the middle button down there, that is the map. And in the map is all of our single player stuff, but you can also choose to go PvP, where you're playing against real players in real time, or you can even do quests where you can earn rewards. Over here, we have our various armies. Now, I'm still relatively new to Warcraft Rumble, but we have two armies unlocked. And you can see they kind of have like the little factions and I haven't done it yet, but for, from what I've read, if you get a full army of the same faction, you get a little bit of a bonus. Again, I haven't got to test that, so it's just something I read. And as you see, you can collect all your favorite heroes and troops from the Warcraft universe. Heroes up top there, and then look at this. We got all these troops we need to discover still. So there's a lot of gameplay that you're going to have to kind of experiment with. You see the army slot right in here. Like I said, as you get new heroes, you can swap out different armies and different units to kind of work with that hero, kind of mix and match and see what's going to work best. And as you work through and level up your minis, you'll actually be able to unlock different talents. So this is my hero, 
Ren Blackhand. And you'll see we got the Legion Air talent, which we have selected. And that's when he takes a little bit of damage. He's going to dismount his Drake and then continue fighting on. And same thing with the rest of the minis. You can unlock different skills for them as you level them up and upgrade them. But you have to, you know, get them leveled up and upgraded. I'm still new, so I don't really have a whole lot of a safe pilot. That's that's what it was. I, I knew it was some kind of pilot. I just didn't know. But as you see here, you can unlock different talents and stuff for all of your different minis in here. And you can easily swap out characters as well. Say we don't think the Griffin Rider is working with this composition. We can go ahead and swap it out. And maybe we want to put in the angry chickens here. Yeah, that's... That's right, we got angry chickens, which are actually pretty annoying to deal with. There's daily offers in the store, like free bonus experience, which we definitely want free bonus experience. Uh, there's little major horde tomes. There's different things you can purchase inside of these offers that are gonna help you progress. As you see here, we can kind of level up since we're using that character. Let's go ahead and get uh, Stonehoof leveled up. Yep, I'm still learning the names. We'll get there, guys. Along with those daily offers in the shop, you have something called the grid, where you get bonuses from buying from the same row or column. I haven't tried this out, and I want to do it right now. I want to get us some new units to kind of play with here today. Ooh, look at that. We get a collection level up. Oops, I shouldn't have clicked that so fast. Oh, what is this? experience boost for anything purchased in this row or column oh. uh okay so in this row or column so we like move this over here uh oh we could okay we can move it over one okay let's go this way and then so it's row or column so it should go both ways i kind of want to get this common drake because that goes with our hero rend uh so maybe we can build that up oh yeah look we get that bonus right there nice all right so i feel like the grid is a good way to go about getting some new characters and getting them leveled up relatively quickly here i kind of want to get some new stuff that we don't have like warsong grunt uh that's a lot but yeah we're getting it we're getting it we're going for it man we're going for it uh what is that a guard duty what oh this thing a common gargoyle that looks sweet uh, let's get a common common gargoyle why not it, it looks really sweet uh we'll, we'll work through here and we'll just play with some of this uh here today Ooh, we need this this goes this goes with our rend uh tunneling miner uh d common dark dark iron miner easy for me to say that tunnels uh, yeah we're gonna get a bunch of new stuff we're gonna try to brand new deck and i'm gonna have no idea what to do here oh we got flame walkers let's let's get some more flame walkers those guys are pretty good. I like those a lot. They do a little bit of a uh, splash damage out in front of them. You get them behind a little bit of a tankier unit. I like that quite a bit. Uh, but we get the star level up for that. So I wonder uh, if that gives us a uh, skill for them. Uh, or do we have to get three? I think, okay, we have to get three of those stars. Uh, I got it. Okay, I got it. We're picking up. I'm picking up what you're putting down. This guy looks nasty. Common abomination. I kind of like this spell. We do have the raptors in there. I also wanted to look to see what our other hero is. Baron, I believe that's undead. So we have undead, and I believe that's Blackrock, uh, which we have a few of those now. So let's uh, let's keep looking here through the grid. Uh, we don't really have anything that kind of goes with that. Uh, should we? Can we just move something? Uh, like move that down, and then does something else come in? No. Okay. Let's just buy the chain lightning. And don't mind the chain lightning. That's what I was using before the execute. It's actually a pretty nice spell, especially dealing with those angry chickens. It chains through, takes out all of the angry chickens. We have fire elemental, right? We're going to get 80 bonus on this. Do we have... Did I buy the fire elemental? I think we're going to buy the fire elemental because we're going to get an 80 bonus on that. Let's do it. Let's do it. If we're if we're really committing to the black rock, which uh, I, I think we are, I, I, think, I think that's the move, right? I think that's the move. Like that. oh my goodness look at that level up oh that is nice guys that is nice and hopefully i'm not just completely off base and like there's no point of going all the same uh family that would be that would be upsetting i just really get intrigued by like all the new cards and i really just want to see what they all do but mostly i want to get a full black rock deck that was my main goal for today's video is to spend all this gold and get me a full black rock deck let's get us more flame walkers because that'll get us another star and get us close to leveling up the flame walkers. All right, nice. Oh, we don't have the living bomb. The living bomb. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's move the living bomb down here. And then let's move the living bomb over here. That way we can get that 50 bonus. Yeah, big brain time, guys. Or I could have just probably moved it one to the right, huh? 
I probably didn't have to move it twice. We're, we're learning. We're learning here. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, I think... Is that enough? Let's see. Let's see if we can go... I feel like it is, right? Let, let's see if we can go and make the full Blackrock deck now. So let's go ahead. Let's swap that in. Let's swap that in. I feel like we have enough, right? Got a little Drake. I don't even know what any of this does yet, but we're throwing it all in. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're, okay. We even have extras. All right. These guys tunnel underground. I feel like that could be useful. Uh, let's take a look. Let me read. Actually, well, the nice thing is if you click a card, you could just see what it does here. Uh, so if we click the info screen, you could actually see it in action here. Check this out. Uh, it's going to go ahead. Oh, oh, that seems nice. All right. Uh, what is this? This is smoke bomb. All right. Oh, smoke bomb makes our guys stealthy. Huh. Let's try this out, though, I think. Uh, fire elemental. I I've seen this guy in action. He's going to deal some nice little splash. Yeah, that's good. That's that's real nice. Let's see this. Uh, the Drake. Okay, so Drake is flying with fire. I already seen him. What does Pyromancer do? Okay, Pyromancer. Uh, okay, just fire. Okay, nice. Okay, let's try these out. Now, don't get me wrong. I love the single player, but let's go try these guys out in PvP. This seems like a fun time, right? Uh, and as you can see here, like, it's feels like a real Warcraft experience, right? Like, for me, like, it was the Murlocs that kind of hit home. Like, I, I remember seeing Murlocs and stuff. Like, uh, I haven't messed around with Warcraft in a long time. Not gonna lie. But, you know, some, some things uh, kind of spark up those memories. All right, so let's go through here. Let's see what we got. Um, all right, so there's another little minor guy. Those little minor guys you get automatically. Let's throw these both in here and let's send our minor in for that chest. The chest always has like two in it. I think they're going to beat us to the chest because I'm over here talking and not paying attention. Oh, oh boy. They got their pilot flying in. They're safe pilot. All right. Uh, okay, nice. We're getting some splash. All right, let's just... Let's just get aggressive here. Let's just get aggressive. We got hero. Uh, I want to try this miner, right? That they go underneath, right? Um, maybe we can mine up here. Uh, let's see. Can we get him out? <laughs> oh, hey guys. Oh, he's chasing him. He's chasing. Him. Uh oh. Oh wait, we got something on our tower. What the heck? Where'd that come from? Oh, pay attention, guys. Pay attention. Oh, there's a safe pilot too. There's a safe pilot. Oh boy. I forgot we're not playing against the computer anymore. Uh, like, or the, the AI. We need to pay attention here. We need to pay attention. All right, let's put this in here. We'll put Pyromancer in also. All right, nice. Good, good. All right, uh, chest comes up there. So let's go. Oh, oh, we already got the chest. Nice. Okay, good, good. Let's, let's just make a really strong push over here. We got a really huge push over there. I see them coming over on the left-hand side. And we'll deal with that. But for now... We're really pushing this right. Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right. We should be able to slow that down. I think we should be able to slow that down. Uh, we'll throw this in here. He's flying, so he should be all right. Oh, wait. They, okay. No, that's fine. That's all taken out. Our Drake works through there. Let's. Can we drill over here? Okay. We can get close with the drill. All right. Nice. Oh, yeah. Look at this, guys. Look at this. We're going to take him out. We're going to take him out. Let's go. Victory. And then we get a little bit of combat experience. Nice, guys. A nice little victory in our PvP match. And we even had some rewards available here. Let's get the Undead Meat Wagon, because I do. I think I want to try the Undead next, uh, since we bought a bunch of Undead cards. Oh, we might as well get our Undead Hero leveled up. All right, nice. Uh, I, I bought that boar because I want to try it, but now like we're committed to Blackrock here, so we got to go with the Power Master. I kind of like the Blackrock. It's like fire and dragons and bunch of powerful stuff i like that quite a bit I'm, I'm just saying i like that a lot personally and as you progress through you'll unlock guilds which i did make us a guild mad ram of course come check it out uh and you're wondering how could you join me well simple download the game with the link down there in the description of course check it out for yourself we're going to continue playing here but i figured it was a good time to remind you guys you could play by checking out the link in the description so our black rock deck seemed to work really well let's see what we have for undead now and look at this. Oh, we have almost full undead. We're going to need one more undead card. Uh, so let's get our meat wagon on there. I have no idea what the meat wagon does. Let's just equip all of our undead stuff here. Uh, throw it in, and then we'll have to go back to the grid and get more. Hopefully, we have enough gold. Okay, do we not have this guy? Common ghoul? I don't think we have a common ghoul. Uh, nice. Unlock. Level up. Perfect. This, oh, nice. And we get a collection level up, guys. Oh, I love it. I love it. What is this, though? 
Cheat death. Preservation spell. Oh, it makes your guys, like, last longer. Okay, I kind of want that. I kind of like the spells a lot. I know we have enough now. Uh, so let's just take a quick look and see what these guys do. Let's, let's take a look at the ghoul because we don't have him in. Uh, a relatively cheap ground unit. Just looks like a little beefy. We could use him as a tank to uh, for a push. Uh, but let's see. We got the meat wagon. Okay, so it's going to stop and throw meat. See, like if we had a ghoul out in front of the meat wagon, that could be good. The abomination is just nasty. These guys... All right, so they're going to deal splash. And look at that. They, they chain and pull people over. Okay, so maybe the Abomination is our tank. Uh, skeleton Party, which is just going to summon a, a party of skeletons. We have a Necromancer, right? Maybe that goes well with Skeleton Party. Is the Necromancer going to summon... Yeah, okay. That's expect exactly what I would expect a Necromancer to do. And then our Gargoyle is our flying unit. Good. Uh, let's go in and let's try another PvP. All right, guys. Let's hop in here. All right, let's, let's go... Let's not hesitate. Let's not hesitate. Uh, as I hesitate. Wait, that wasn't the Necromancer. I thought that was the Necromancer. That was the spell. Okay, that's fine, though. That's fine. Uh, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Uh, we have our hero. We have stuff. All right, we're... Do we just go with a really strong push early here? It kind of seems dirty, but I think we're going to do it. All right. Oh, look at that. That hero, like, charges ahead. I don't have any abilities for that hero. Like I said earlier, I just unlocked it, but... Uh, the hero, like, just charges ahead, so that could be really nice. Alright, we're getting some skeletons spawned in here. Oh, look at this push we already got. We got a meat wagon. Alright, let's go ahead and throw one of these abominations in with a meat wagon. <laughs> meat wagon. Oh, that's so rude. Uh, let's see. Do we have our spell? We have spells here. Uh, we can just make these guys last a little bit longer, right? Alright, we're, we're cooking. We're working. I think I wasted that spell. Not gonna lie. I think I wasted it. Let's go with the gargoyle up the middle to try to get that chest we're also summoning skeletons i wonder if that's just an undead thing or maybe that's our bonus for using all undead we have skeletons just randomly summoning i wonder i wonder all right we're gonna go back here oh look at that abomination do work abominations don't yeah look we got more skeletons spawning that is sick that is sick look we can throw these skeletons in skeleton party it's a skeleton party nice and they just come in here and they do some work the abomination's working. We got our uh, meat wagon. <laughs> Undead is kind of goofy, but it's actually pretty good. I kind of want to mess with these playing around to progress through the PvE, which there is rewards for progressing through that. I just want to try these out in PvP, but let's talk about the rewards of playing like the single player missions. So there's over 70 single player missions, not to mention weekly events. There's dungeons, raids, and a lot more stuff that I haven't even experienced for myself yet. But there's a lot of rewards for just playing through here. As you play through and uh, defeat these levels, you're gonna earn sigils, which you're gonna unlock different things. At level uh, 22, which is our next one, we're gonna get an arc light surge, which I don't even know what that is. Uh, I, can we choose which one we want? Let's do this one because we get the lightning bolt and that allows us to level something up. I, I'm pretty sure we can level up a hero with those lightning bolt things. Oh well, yeah, that's good. I probably shouldn't be saying lightning bolt things, but again, I'm, I'm learning guys. I'm learning. It's new. Like it's literally a brand new game out here to me. All right, let's, let's go out here. Yeah, I feel like our bonus from using all undead is that we get these little skeletons spawning in here. I feel like that's a thing. All right, let's, let's get a meat wagon in here. Let's get, uh, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, let's go with a little air to take out these raptors. I feel like that could be good. We need something to push the left, which we'll get there. We'll get there. Um, do we go with our abomination on the left, I think? I think we go abomination on the left here. Let these guys get in a little bit closer. Actually, the abomination will pull them in. We don't even need to let them get in. Yeah, look at that. Uh, the abomination pulls them in with its chain. That's nice. All right, so we're pushing through there. All right, let's send in our hero. Let's actually, let's do that. <laughs> Slow him down. Oh, which we could use that to, like, uh, collect chests. I didn't even think about that. Man, so, like, you see, like, you get those chests, you get extra gold, which will help you deploy stuff faster. There's so much that's going on in this, and, like, we have so much to learn. I should have put our hero up top here. Why didn't I put our hero up top here? Our hero has the charge, though. Our hero's gonna work through there. It'll be nice. Uh, we got our meat wagon working. Let's go ahead and let's make our hero last a little bit longer here. Okay, nice, nice. Uh, good. That's real good. And let's throw in... 
I, I don't even know where I want to throw it. I don't even know where I want to throw it, guys. Put him over here. Let's throw this over here. Yeah, that way we can grab that. Nice. All right, perfect. Oh, yeah, we're cooking, guys. We're cooking. This hero is done for. Undead is pretty nasty, man. Undead is pretty nasty. Look at that. We get right on through there. The gargoyle gets leveled up. Nice, guys. You got to have some flying in there. I've learned you got to have some flying to go with, like, some of your ground stuff. But now we can claim our reward from that level, which also gets us 22 sigils, which gets us uh this uh let's see how does surge zones arc light sparks appear all right so we is it, it's a new zone uh okay i uh and just like that arc light surge okay <laughs> mission missions and surge zones give coins but they're a bit more challenging oh harder missions huh. okay i like it i like it so as you see here, there's a lot of depth to this game. It's not just like, you know, go play PvP or PvE. There's a lot of depth to these missions and these quests and I, uh, the dungeon raids and all the stuff I haven't even got to try yet. There's so much in here for you to do. I'm going to hop in here and go on one of these arc like quests, one of these harder quests, so to speak. And let's just see what we can do. Let's put, let's put this in. But it's a good time. Again, guys, if you want to check this game out, the link will be down there in the description so you guys can check it out play it join my guild as you progress through here i can see having a lot of fun with this game i'm not gonna lie i was a little bit skeptical because i'm i'm not like the biggest warcraft fan but like you don't have to know anything about warcraft to play this game i think that's what i like most about it uh, uh oh do you guys see this push that's coming over here i don't like that i don't like that it's got our necromancer going uh, see, this is why you need some air units, but our gargoyle's over there on the right. Uh, but luckily, we distracted enough. Okay, we're pushing, we're going, we're going. We have our skeleton party. Oh, let's let's skeleton party their chest. <laughs> Give me that! Give me that! Uh, also, like, okay, so this is what I was talking about earlier. Like, you can change the direction of where your stuff goes on the map. Uh, that's really cool as well. Uh, and, like, really kind of control the pace and the flow of the game if you want. All right, we're working through here. We're good. All right, nice. We get our skeletons. All right, they got air units coming. I don't think our grotesque can hit the air units. Actually, let's just save that. All right, so we'll get that for free, essentially. Uh, I think we'll put grotesque in over here. Uh, and then we'll put gargoyle in. There's a lot going on right now. It's a lot going on. All right, nice, nice. Uh, what do we got going on over here on the right? I don't like it. I don't like it. All right, our grotesque is under a lot of fire. Can the necromancer hit those guys? I feel like he can, no? Yeah, necromancer can hit him. Okay, that works. But the vultures are really annoying. Like, as the vultures take out something, they summon a new one. I kind of want to get the beast hero. Well, I guess we could just play beast. But I kind of just want to get the beast. I want to just, like, go all, like, get the bonuses. Look at all these vultures. What the heck? This, this vulture is summoning vultures. Imagine that. Uh, let's go with our hero over this way. With a meat wagon! <laughs> give me that meat wagon! <laughs> that's... Oh, that's, that's interesting. <laughs> I probably shouldn't say give me that meat wagon. Uh, let's actually just put our skeletons back here because I think there's some ranged ones in here which can take out some of these air units. Yeah, yeah, that works. Let me get our gargoyle working. Okay. Uh, let's put our meat wagon, or put that in with the meat wagon. Also get our little miner guy going up there. Okay, nice. Good, good. We're working through here. We're pushing. Look at the meat wagon throwing rotten meat. Disgusting. Disgusting. What is wrong with you, meat wagon? Let's put our hero over here. Uh, maybe we can even make these guys last a little bit longer. Oh, wait, wait. Those vultures are coming. That's not good. That's not good. Uh-oh. Uh That's not good at all. All right. Our hero gets through there. Uh, but we need... Uh-oh. 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 We're under a little pressure here, guys. These missions are harder. Yeah, I guess they warned me that the missions are harder. I should have listened. I think we're fine, though. I think we're fine. All right. Our, he our hero got taken out. Uh... Okay, okay, we got Gargoyle over here. Let's get the Grotesque. The Grotesque is pretty nasty. Those little chickens, man. I'm missing my Chain Lightning spell. Chain Lightning deals with those chickens so well, man. So, so well. Right, they are getting a lot of gold here, though. All right, Gargoyle gets through there. That's good. But we need something to work through here. I don't think Meat... Can Meat Wagon hit the air? I don't think it can. Wait, can it? Or was it going for the other guy? Throw our hero in over here. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, we got a nice little push going over there. Uh, let's throw him over here to grab that. All right, good. Let's, uh, let's put this in here. Oh, we missed the grotesque, but that's all right. Grotesque is working. Uh, put Necromancer over there. 
skeleton party. Nice! We got it down! We get the victory! On the harder missions, guys, I like this a lot. Oh, it's so much fun. So like I said, guys, if you want to check out Warcraft Rumble, link is down there in the description. There is a ton to do in this game. I don't think you're ever going to be bored with this. So make sure you check it out and let me know what was your favorite thing you saw in today's video. Maybe we have to check this one out a little bit more because uh, it's got me a little bit intrigued. I'm not going to lie. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this Warcraft Rumble video. Huge shout out to Blizzard for sponsoring this one for us. If you guys did enjoy it, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. You guys have a great day. Keep on clash bashing.